starting point where Jordan, Louise and Elizabeth have all survived to play in round two. In this round, they'll each have 30 seconds to answer as many questions as possible. Every correct answer will give them a counter to play into the machine. As before, the player with the lowest score at the end of the round will leave the game with absolutely nothing. So, Elizabeth, you are leading from round one, which means it's your choice. You can play first if you think the machine's ready. Alternatively, you could ask Louise or Jordan to play. I think the machine's ready. I'll go first, please. All right, here we go, Elizabeth. 30 seconds for you. Every time you get a question mark, I'll give you a counter. If you don't know, just say pass, OK? 30 seconds for Elizabeth, please. Your time starts now. In which Asian country did the Bollywood film industry originate? India. Correct. In 1972, which member of the Jackson 5 reached the top 10, aged only 14, with a single Ben? Michael. Correct. Which relative of the cucumber is commonly grown for use as a bath or dish sponge? Uh, Cochet. Lufa. <laughs> which TV chef wrote the book How to Be a Domestic Goddess? Um... Uh, Delia Smith. Nigella Lawson. Nigella. At the 2017 Cheltenham Festival, which prestigious horse race was won by Sizing John? Pass. It's the Gold Cup. Oh, 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 sorry. <laughs> you made me laugh in the middle of that. <laughs> you kept your yes. concentration somehow. Two correct answers. It started so well. It did. You were flying. Which relative of the cucumber is commonly grown for use as a bath or dish sponge? It's not a courgette. No. <laughs> it's a loofah. Obviously, obviously oh. not. <laughs> <laughs> but you have got two counts. You've got a nice lead. So where would you like to put the first one? Um, I'll put the first one, please, in drop zone three. Fire up three, please. Jordan, set that top shelf. Quite ponderous drop. That is pretty good. Nice. Should get something in. Yeah. Let's put a lot in. We've not had many out. That's nice. Ooh, lovely stuff, Elizabeth. Nine counters drop, 450 pounds. And you've got a mystery prize as well, Elizabeth. You've won yourself a G-Tech cordless lawnmower. Lovely. I've got a very big lawn, so that's... Brilliant. Amazing. You are now going to be able to mow it without a cable. I think my husband will appreciate it. <laughs> yeah, there you go. More importantly. Uh, you've got one more count to put in as well, Elizabeth. Um, could I change, please, and go to drop zone four? You can. Light up four, please. <laughs> clean drop. Quick, clean drop. Down in the middle, the mystery goes. Yep. Tipping point looks pretty good as well, doesn't it, Elizabeth? Oh, that's another belter. <laughs> wow. So that's another 11 across the tipping point, which is another 550 pounds. Takes you to a thousand there, Elizabeth. Very nicely done. Let's take that from the machine and put it into your bank. You only had two counts, but what damage you did. 1,800 pounds, well done. Thank you. Right, Jordan, it's your choice now. If you think the machine's ready, you could play. Alternatively, you could ask Louise to maybe fill it out for you. I will pass. Okay. Elizabeth just has rinsed most of the machine. Yeah. So, Louise, unfortunately, you don't get a choice as you're in last <laughs> place. 30 seconds for Louise, please. Your time starts now. In the human body, the rarest type of which fluid is AB? Blood. Correct. In US currency, how many dimes are there in a dollar? Four. Ten. Which composer won a Best Dramatic Score Oscar for the 1997 film Titanic? Pass. James Warner. The brand Hovis is best known for producing loaves of which baked food? Bread. Correct. During Euro 2016, which Nordic nation became known for their famous celebration, the Thunderclap? Pass. Iceland. Famous for its tarts, the market town of Bakewell is located in which English national park? Pass. Or oh, it's the Peak District. <laughs> Louise. Two correct answers in there. Two counters. Now, Elizabeth did a lot of damage with her too. So, where would you like to start? I think I'm going to go for drops on four, please, Ben. Line up four for us, please. Two good ones here, Louise. If we can. Yes. Top shelf's working for you. It's the bottom. something? Gonna give out. Yeah, it does. <laughs> <laughs> Two drop. 100 pounds across the tipping point. You're off the mark. We're up and running. One more to go, Louise. I think the top shelf isn't as great on drop zone four, mm. so we'll go for drop zone one, please. Okay, gonna come to drop zone one, please. <laughs> switch to the other end let's see if this works out for you louise hopefully just need a nice clean drop it wasn't clean but it's flat you need three counts to catch jordan to put the pressure on him oh now as it spreads slightly the mystery's down are they gonna go oh louise i'm sorry it's not gonna be enough 
hundred pounds did drop though. Let's take it and put it into your bank. Sadly, with three hundred fifty pounds, we are going to be losing it at the end of the round. That's okay. Right, Jordan, we come back to you now. Thirty seconds for Jordan, please. Your time starts now. Sonna is the German word for which celestial body? Sun. Correct. Oscar-winning actress Rachel Weisz married which James Bond star in 2011? Piers Morgan. Daniel Craig. Spanning Johnston's Bay, Anzac Bridge is in which Australian city? Sydney. Correct. In the 2017 general election, which environmentalist party was re-elected to its only seat? Green Party. Correct. Crocodile Rock was a 1972 UK hit for which British singer? Pass. Elton John. In 2014, Game of Thrones actor Kit Harington starred as Milo in which film set in the year 79 AD? Pass. Pompeii. <laughs> <laughs> Three correct answers in there, Jordan. But what an answer you gave me. Uh, Oscar winning actress Rachel Vice married which James Bond star in 2011? Piers Morgan? Oh, I meant Piers Brosnan. Yes, you did. You just made Piers Morgan's life. I didn't even know. He will be made up. You've confused him with James Bond. His head's big enough already. <laughs> Three correct answers, though, Jordan. So still every chance uh, that you can close the gap a little bit on Elizabeth here. What do you fancy? I'm going to go for drop zone one. The bottom shelf looks fully loaded compared yeah. to the others. Louise just set them up a touch as well, didn't she? Fire up one, please. <laughs> Stays on its edge. Right. Wasn't in a rush, was it? Don't right. Don't yes, it is. Flat. Flat. Yeah, you're okay. Yeah. As that comes forward, you could get that silver one down. With a good shove. There we go, nice. Oh, oh that's nice. There is a good spread, you're right. Oh. Okay, not to worry. Still got two more to play with, Jordan. Uh, yeah, I'm sticking with drop zone one again, please. Let's have one, please. That was more rapid. Let's get something over. Oh, no, 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 fill that gap. Okay, one more counter here. Yeah, all in. Drop zone one again. All right, please. Third time lucky, all right? Very quick draw. Quick, wasn't it? That's going to slide behind those silver ones, I think. There you go, there. Spreading a touch. Can we get you some money, Jordan? We need it. Have to. Yeah, we do. Well yeah. Four counts of drop. Well done. Two hundred pounds there. Let's take that from the machine. Put it straight in your bank. And that means at the end of the round, Elizabeth is out in the lead with one thousand eight hundred pounds. Jordan goes through with seven hundred pounds. Louise, I'm so sorry, but with three hundred fifty pounds, that means we have found your tipping point. Thank you for playing. Thanks for having me. Our pleasure. So it's Jordan and Elizabeth who'll be going head to head after the break for the right to play for our ten thousand pound jackpot. Now, though, it's your chance to win an amazing cash prize. 